Today, guys, is gonna be one of the most asked for video in the CDT community. It is the challenge between the Bugatti Bleed versus the brand new Red Bull RB17 car right over here, guys. Which of the two hypercars is the best? And today, guys, we are gonna go head to head between these two cars and see who is the fastest. But before we get started with this video, guys, we should smash that thumbs up button, subscribe if you guys have it. And don't forget to click that post notification bell we're gonna see which of these two cars are the fastest leave your answers in the comments down below right now guys who are you for team bleed or team red bull let's get this video started all right to start off this video guys we have this bugatti bullied right here now this car has been the king of the hyper cars forever like it's been on the top of the list for the longest time now we have uh two new upcomers which is the brand new lavish valkyrie pro uh and of course the brand new rb17 of course the uh you know the yesco was on top but of course the bolid was always number one when it came to the track but now we got two more faster cars than the bolid guys we got the lavish pro right over here or the amr pro and the rb17 the crazy part about this guys the rb17 fully upgrade goes 329 miles an hour with a 9.6 handling with the bugatti only going 316 now you guys can see the rb17 it looks exactly like the amr pro but the question is why is it faster than the valkyrie guys well that the question is is because of the engine guys the engine that they stuck on this is a lot different than what they have on the valkyrie pro and also the aerodynamics on this car is absolutely insane and making it one of the most uh you know agile car in the track the crazy part about this car is it doesn't even have a 10 handling, but it has somewhat better of a handling than the Bolide. I think what makes this car a lot better than Bolide, guys, is probably the top speed. But does that really matter in the drag race, the circuit race, and last but not least, in the brand new season 12 race? Let's find out. All right, the first car we're off, guys. We got a 1 4th mile lap or a drag race right here with the Bolide fully upgraded. You guys can see it hits 6.4 out of 197 miles an hour. Now, that's incredible, guys. That's insane speed. 6.4, but... I have never personally raced the RB17 yet on the drag race. So I want to see what this actually does. All right, here we go. Now we get the RB17. Oh my gosh, dude. The acceleration on this car is absolutely insane. Oh my gosh, 5.9 224 miles an hour. Dude, that's not even fair. What? That's like a whole half a second off with the RB17 and we went over 200 miles an hour. We couldn't even go with the bullied with that. Dude, I have to check out the half mile race just because, wow, that's insane. All right, you guys can see we did a second trial run with the bullied 6.6 .6 at 199. Okay, not bad, not bad. All right, let's do that again, but this time I kind of want to do the half mile and it looks like we got a couple of contestants right over here and yeah let's see how much the half mile goes with the bull lead here we go i'm gonna definitely win this one look at this we got a camaro z01 and two mclarens I'm definitely winning this one here we go oh we almost hit that wall bro but let's see how fast we get 9.8 at 258 miles an hour 258 miles is not bad but can the rb17 hit 300 Oh, let's find out. All right, here we go. First person mode with the RB17. And dude, we just take off like a rocket ship, man. Oh my gosh. Yo. Are we going to hit 300? Yo, look at that. 8.8 .8 at 293 miles an hour. Now that's close. Wow. I don't think that's... uh. I don't think that's gonna be a lot, you know, a lot more than the Bolide, but that's faster than the Bolide, guys. That is insane. <laughs> now, I gotta say that the RB17 most likely has a faster acceleration, but let's test it out in the circuit track, guys. Let's see which car is faster lap-wise. All right, we are off with uh, the Bugatti Bolide, guys. The king of the track, or it might be the former king of the track today, guys, because... 
we're gonna be seeing the RB17 versus the Bolide today and see which one is faster. Now, I do notice a huge difference when it came between the RB17 and the Bolide, guys. The RB17 does seem like it has a faster acceleration versus the Bolide, which has a decent acceleration, but the RB17 is just way too fast. Here we go. Let's see what we get. 32.5. Now, I, I want to say that's probably not the best I've gotten around the track. I think I can do a little bit better. All right, here we go. 31.8. Much like it. That's a lot better. You guys can see the total time is 2.44. Not bad. Now, let's see what the RB17 does. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's show you the power of this RB17. Now, I started this race a little bit late. Now, let's uh, see how fast we can catch up to these other cars right here, guys. Now, the car in front of us is the Porsche 919 EVO, the hybrid EVO. So, you guys already know that's one of the fastest track cars in the game. But look how fast this actually catches up to that car. Here we go, guys. The straight is probably the most uh, advantage of this RB17, guys. It is so fast in the straights that it's just insane to how much it catches up to other hypercars. Even if we make mistakes like this, I know we can still probably finish in first place. Now, with the speed, guys, you do have to manage all turns like that and braking because of how fast this vehicle is but it's really not that hard guys here we go look at this we're coming up to this car already guys oh my gosh this is insane of how fast we're catching up to him like we started super late and we messed up here we go caught up let's go <laughs> dude the rv17 caught up to the porsche no way oh my goodness dude all right we did pretty bad laps so let's see if we can set a pretty good lap time right here guys i love this car this is literally my new favorite car in the game like you can't even catch up with the bully doing that guys this car just has a faster acceleration than the bully does and i think that's where the advantage is the bully does have a slight better handling but this one is just insane look at this guys look at that 29.8 seconds <laughs> no way and we messed up so much time and we still got a 247 versus a 244 with the bugatti bully and we didn't barely mess up with that one wow 29.8 that just tells you a lot right there guys we don't even have to do that again that is fast i lapped my boy twice right there all right we got another subscriber right over here that was nice enough to actually pull out the bugatti bullied you already know that the bugatti bullied is gonna get beat 100 percent. so this is probably gonna be the most unfair race ever all right guys here we go the bugatti bullied versus the rb17 and you guys can see the rb17 just takes off immediately now this car is slightly bigger than the bullied but look how fast it just moves around the corner and the braking on this is insanely good guys like it's not even bad at all it's really really good and i don't even have to brake around these corners i just have to slow down and let off the gas and we can turn on a dime look at this yo oh dude let's go dude the bully is like right behind us he is struggling to catch up and i'm breaking early on some of these turns too guys i'm not even gonna lie to you i'm breaking way too early look he's like super close to me i'm spinning out that's not good he's way too good for me but let's see if i can catch up to him I'm a little bit rusty right now i'm not gonna lie but I'm sure we got a pretty good lap in. And this car is as big as the F1 cars, guys. You guys already know how much I struggle with those cars on these types of tracks right over here. So it's actually pretty cool that, you know, it's not a bad thing that we're crashing into these walls because it is the size of an F1 car. But look at this. It's always this turn right here, guys. That I'm spinning out on. It's always that one. It's usually this one too, but no. Gosh, look, he got a 40 second. And I got a 41. This is not happening. I gotta win this one, bro. Let's do this again. Look at this, guys. I can catch up to the bully like super easily on the straights. Oh my gosh. But on the turns, guys, the bully is just really, really fast with it. But look at this. We can catch up to the bullied really quickly. Oh my goodness. Let's go, guys. P1. Oh, I'm lapping this guy right here. Let's go. Dude, we are doing so much better on this race. Oh my goodness, I don't want to jinx it. 
Dude, we gotta get a good lap time right here, man. We gotta get the best. Here we go, the last straight. That was the last turn, guys. And there's that bleed. Oh, there's not even the bleed behind us. Look at that. 39.3. <laughs> Oh my goodness, dude. And that is the belief behind us. And he barely caught up to us. Look at the lap time difference, guys. That is insane. <laughs> that is crazy, guys. This is absolutely fast, man. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, be sure to smash that thumbs up button. Subscribe for more, guys. What did you think about this? Bugatti Bullied versus RB17 video, guys. I want to know your honest opinion in the comments down below. Do you guys want to see more of this? And also, what other cars would you like to go against the RB17? I'll leave you in the comments down below. I'll see you guys in the next video, and peace out.